Hi, good evening, everyone. Um, today is November 27th, 2019. Tomorrow is Wednesday. It's currently 7.30 p.m. And I'm just starting the vlog now. Um, so not sure how much content is going to happen. Um, but I did get my nails done. We got a fresh set of claws. Um, you guys know that feeling like when you get your, your fresh set of nails on, like all you really want to do is like talk with your hands. Like that's what I do. That's how I'm feeling right now. That's not good. <laughs> it's so cringy. Um, but yeah, so I'm not sure if I'm going to go out tonight or what. I think I definitely need to like pack, uh, for my trip because I do leave on Friday, um, to go to Arizona and I need to pack. For me, I need to pack the dog stuff up. Um, they're coming with me when I go over to my friends tomorrow for Thanksgiving. Um, so we just need to get all of our stuff together. Um, yeah, I think I'm going over there tomorrow in the morning. Uh, hopefully pretty early, help cook and set up for Thanksgiving and that kind of stuff. Uh, but yeah, so I figured I'd just start the vlog. I don't know what kind of content is gonna be in this vlog but I figured I'd try so yeah. so yeah so I'm gonna try to pack for the trip uh I am leaving on Friday like I said so I don't have enough time I don't really have a lot of time between now Thanksgiving and then I leave Friday so let's try and pack I'm going to Arizona and New Mexico um and probably take this this little bag this small little bag I love this bag it is really excellent for traveling I bought it off of Amazon probably for like I don't know thirty dollars um but it's like the perfect cute little backpack I've traveled actually like I've traveled a week in this before um so it's excellent and I always take this with me as like my personal item and then I have this which is my carry on which is super 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 cute um it's by Vince Camuto um it's just super cute I like it a lot so we're gonna try to pack and see how much we can get in here um <clears throat> so I do uh travel quite a bit um I have been backpacking through Europe twice so I found that when I'm trying to pack small and I, I like to travel like light, I like to travel light. Um, but something that helps me a lot when I'm like trying to pack a bunch of stuff in these little tiny things is like packing cubes. I've got all my packing cubes in here. I bought these off of Amazon too. Um, honestly, Amazon is fantastic. I can try to link, um, link my stuff here in the description down below obviously not sponsored um just just stuff that I really like um so yeah so I looked at the weather and apparently I am stupid and didn't realize that like New Mexico and Arizona gets cold like I had no idea like literally we planned this trip because I wanted to go somewhere warm so I figured like oh you know let's go to the fucking desert and turns out like we're going during a cold front and it's going to be 32 degrees in the Grand Canyon and in New Mexico. Like that's like what? So much for my like warm vacation. Anyway. Yeah. So <clears throat> these packing cubes comes with one really large one, one medium sized one, um, one a little bit smaller and then a tiny, tiny one. And I use this one for like my, um, undergarments, uh, I usually put like shirts and stuff in here um, and then I put I either take this one for um, my more bulky stuff if I have more room or I just put everything in here I usually don't take these two together uh, because they usually don't fit in either the backpack that I travel in or in my carry-on so since it's gonna be a little chilly I think that I'm gonna try to pack everything in these smaller ones because I'm gonna try to bring like heavier stuff um yeah so i'm gonna bring a couple pairs of jeans 
Oh, you know what? Hang on a second. I need to, like, get all my fucking laundry out of the um, dryer because I'm very irresponsible. I hate putting away laundry. Like, I hate it. Like, I'll wash it and I'll put it in the dryer, but, like, taking it from the dryer, taking it from, like, my hamper and actually putting all my clothes back away, like, is really uh, a point where I could use a lot of improvement. So, um, hang on. Let me try and get all my stuff because I'm gonna probably pause pack most of it, so. The only saving grace about this is once I get to this point where I'm like doing my laundry, I will, I'll put it all away, right? I'm gonna put it all of this, this stuff away. But I need to figure out what I'm trying to bring with me. I think that I need to bring like, Kiwi, please. Hey, get out of my stuff. Um, I think I need to bring like two, two pairs of jeans, three, probably three. I'll probably bring like three pairs of jeans because we're gonna be doing a lot of like hiking and it's cold, so I'm gonna need a couple pairs of jeans. I think that, um, I'm, I think I'm gonna bring like a dress uh, or something to go out in. I'll probably bring like a couple dresses. I'll bring, well, maybe not a dress. I think I'm gonna bring a dress and like tights um, to like go out in because just in case, like my bag that I'm traveling with, she loves, she loves to go out, right? She usually takes me, she in, inspires me to go out. That's not true. I like to go out too. I don't know what I'm saying. Um, so yeah. So bring some stuff to go out in. I don't know. There's like something on my jeans. That I don't know where it came from, like this stain. But they're like black jeans. Like how the fuck did you stain your black jeans? Mm -hmm. Bring a tide stick, I guess. I'm gonna bring some booties to go out into. Cause like, so like I was in charge of, um, for like our trip planning, I was in charge of all the daytime activities, like the, like the stuff in the daytime. Um, wow, I'm like super well-spoken. Um, so anyway, so I was in charge of our daytime activities. So I found all of like the national parks and like all of the like cool outdoor things that we're gonna do. I planned all that. And then she planned, can you stop squeaking? It's so rude. She planned like um, where we're gonna go to dinner and like what kind of bars or um, like what kind of nighttime fun we wanna have in each city because we're taking a road trip. Um, like I said, we're taking a road trip and I think, I think that that's, you know, gonna be good for us to go out. I literally don't even know what I'm saying. Like, is this even interesting? I have no idea. I guess we'll figure it out. So, yeah. So, this is good for me. You guys will help me actually get this done instead of just, like, sitting on my butt and, like, chilling, waiting for, like, my friends to text me back because I think that we're going to try to go out tonight. Just go out locally around the bars. I'm gonna take this with me. Um, need to make sure I take like a sports bra too, just in case we're doing some some very vigorous activities. So I'm really excited to go on this trip. I think um, I think I'm probably most excited uh, to see the Grand Canyon. Like I've wanted to see the Grand Canyon so badly for a long time now. And now I get the opportunity, so pretty, pretty stoked about it. Um, and I'm, I, I don't know why, like, I don't, I didn't ever think to like go to New Mexico. So like how this trip started was I, um, originally needed 
to take my vacation from work, right? Because it doesn't like roll over or anything. Can you stop? That's so rude. Um, our vacation. Stop! It's rude. Um, our vacation doesn't roll over, so like you have to take it. Um, and if you don't take it, you lose it. So obviously, I'm gonna try to take my vacation. So I had to use this week, and I figured this next week after Thanksgiving, um, in terms of uh, stuff that's going on professionally for me, is the least amount of impact, which I found after I tried to prep today to make sure that I didn't leave like my team in a bad shape. There's like just so much going on, but apparently it's really never a good time to take vacation. Um, so I, just folding laundry now at this point, just deciding what to take. Um, so I don't know where I was going. Okay. Right, right, right. So I, um, I'm taking vacation and originally I wanted to go backpack through Southeast Asia. Um, but my friends said that they couldn't really swing it at that point. At, well, at this point in time, they couldn't really like afford to fly over there and like go backpacking and like actually enjoy the time like as much time as we would want to spend there which is like true too because like I'd like to spend at least more than like we're going now on this trip for nine days and I'd like to spend at least a little bit more than that uh over there so so that was fine I agreed with that like we didn't need to go we didn't need to go uh to Southeast Asia so then I started looking at like where I wanted to go and I decided I wanted to be warm so I picked a road trip down like the southern states. I'm a little wacky when I like plan trips. Um, I had us originally going from New Orleans to Austin to Houston, then driving all the way to New Mexico and like stopping in New Mexico and seeing random stuff in there and then uh, flying out of Arizona. And then thank God my, my big, she, reels me in a little bit and tells me to be a little bit less crazy. So, <clears throat> so she looked at the itinerary and she goes, Morgan, you're doing it again. You're being a little crazy. Uh, we need to like put it down to just a couple states. So we picked, um, we picked New Mexico and Arizona because, um, like New Orleans is something that you can definitely do in a weekend. Like so is Austin and Houston. Like those are like weekend trip kind of places where like I could easily like swing a weekend trip there and like we don't have to go on like a big road trip. But like you would never think to be like, oh, you know what? I think I'm going to go spend a weekend in New Mexico, right? Like that's that's a little weird. So that's how we landed on we're going to New Mexico. So yeah. And I thought it was going to be warm in the desert. And it's not. So we're going during a cold front. Apparently the weather is supposed to be anywhere from like the 60s to like the 30s. So I'm going to have to bring a winter jacket. Like I'm going to be cold. Like today in South Carolina it was 72 degrees. I'm not ready. <laughs> Definitely not ready for it. But yeah. So I don't know. I think that's it. I think that's all I have to really talk about. I'm gonna finish packing and um, I'll check back in with you guys in a little bit. Okay. All right, guys. So here's just my little outfit of the night. We're going out in our little, I don't know, just my little outfit of the night. Um. So yeah, so I am going out with my friends. So I will talk with you guys tomorrow. Okay, see you, bye.